last time I miscounted, there's actually three more levels to go through, rather than two more levels to go through, so this is going to be a fun thing, but it kind of seems like this is actually the final thing we have to do, because all three locks, as you can see on the right-hand side of the screen, are back to back to back to back, so it feels like we have to do these three levels, then a final boss level, and then we finish the game, but before we can do any of that, we need to fight this uh, little knight dude over here, which uh, doesn't look too awfully intimidating, but uh, I've been wrong about this kind of thing before, so let's hope that we make our way over here, and is there any secrets over here? Of course there is not. I now know that I can do this, <laughs> which helps a lot, uh, switching magic, that is. Uh, could you please attack? Or just turn around, that also works. Oh, okay, I guess we're doing this. Just waiting for you to turn around so I can attack you. How money, how much health do you have? You seem like you have way too- God, fuck you. Okay, so um, maybe instead we can uh, use this magic. Okay, that, of course that was the last hit. Of course it was the last hit. It, it wouldn't ever be something nice. I, I guess it being last hit is nice because that means it is now in fact dead. Uh, let's try not to die. I'm going to take it very easy here because I don't like... Well, I do like... <laughs> that's a lot of money. Uh, I am terrified of this darkness mechanic. I didn't even know there was a platform up there. That could have gone horribly wrong if there was anything else than just a platform. <laughs> Boy, no, no. You know what? That kind of works for me. Fuck you. I don't care. That went remarkably well. Um, let's save the encounter with you for a little later on. Maybe I'll do some overworld stuff today, because we still need to do this as well. We'll keep that for when we have some time to fill at the end of an episode. Let's do this icy level. That's always a good idea to do. Um, first. Wait, we don't have ice physics? Oh, we do have ice physics. Okay, I, I, was, I was really happy there for a moment. Until I wasn't. So fuck me. So this shouldn't be... Okay, we, we can't actually make it all the way up there. It doesn't seem that much higher, but apparently jumping from ice is also a little different, maybe, than jumping from normal ground. I don't know how this exactly works, but this doesn't seem too bad so far. So far, this actually seems kind of pleasant, especially compared to the uh, non-solid version of this level. And if you're wondering what the hell I'm talking about, I'm talking about the water level. Because this is the ice level, because it's the science and stuff. I am so fucking hilarious, you have no idea. Y you you guys can't even appreciate my vain attempts at humor, uh, is, is, if I'm being honest, is what it is. Uh, you're a Viking. I, I'm not entirely sure how the timeline between knights and Vikings lines up, but I feel like there's a fair bit of time between them. With, with knights being much later on the timeline than... than and Vikings, but maybe it's just a geographic difference because obviously Vikings are more so like Nordic, right? I think. <laughs> and knights are much more uh, English. So maybe they were around the same period of time. I have no freaking clue, honestly. Uh, but so far, I am quite enjoying this level and that is highly worth it. So I'm going to take that. Because I'm, uh, I'm in a roll. I'm feeling good about this level. I've never played this level before. I've never even seen this level before. As a matter of fact, I thought after the last level, we would be near the end of the game. That does not turn out to be the case at all. Uh, a, a little something funny that is a, a thing that I want to talk about is that I, as of today, uploading this, uh, or, or recording this rather, I put some time into uh, making some shorts, that could have been bad, out of the last, like, four episodes. <laughs> and I... I don't know when this is being uploaded. I think this is being uploaded on Friday, as what I want to say. Um, I have shorts until, like, Christmas. It's kind of insane. Uh, don't explode me. Thank you. So that's, uh, that, that's fun, I guess. Uh, this certainly has to give me something good, right? It does not. It's literally just a trap. Okay. Fuck me, I guess. You can walk under that. You know? <laughs> no, no, no. No. 
That's cat you have a living crap out. Don't do that again. That's not nice. That's very not nice. Can I? I can't even. Oh, I hate that. I hate everything about that. Well, let's do that again. Get in there. Wasn't that difficult? Matter that I know how that mechanic works with the, with the falling snow. Shouldn't be that big of a deal either. Um, especially if we can just keep using the upper path here rather than the lower path. Actually, it's not that big a deal to use the lower path because I'm just ignoring all of the enemies. Turns out, if you ignore the enemies, the games become really, really easy. Just all games. Not all games. There's games without enemies to begin with, which still are going to be very difficult. I'm assuming I can't bounce on you, by the way. Yeah, I, I mean, I can bounce on you, but it won't damage you. So, um, you... Honestly, fuck off. No, th there is something up there. I, I can tell, but I can't make the jump back and th there's money waiting for me. There is money waiting for me and I'm not about to give up on like a thousand gold just because I'm curious. So I guess whenever we inevitably die again... Um... <laughs> There is, this is not even a pixel perfect thing. We're talking sub pixels to the point where I'm actually not comfortable turning around, and I had to walk to the left just to be comfortable enough to talk uh, to to walk back to the right. There, that was insane, and we don't expect to have that happen to us again. So, don't take the risk. I hate ice physics, dude. I, I, I get why platformers use it. And there is a non-zero chance that at some point in my own platformer I will end up using it, but fuck, I hate it. That being said, it's it's less common in 3D platformers, uh, probably because it's less problematic in 3D platformers, or it's so much more problematic in 3D platformers, this is a thing that I'm just going to have to test out, uh, that people just don't use it because it's actually bullshit, uh, not being able to control your character in a 3D space like that. It... it, it <sighs> The snow mechanic, it's, it's really kind of throwing me, not gonna lie. Okay, so we jump, we jump, we jump, and then what do we do? Okay, we can just dig it up. Uh, we jump, we jump. I don't care how you are supposed to get that ruby. I am not taking this checkpoint's value. I, this is a checkpoint. That is horrifying. Uh, this also is quite horrifying. What the hell? Wait, what the? <laughs> what? I, this mechanic is weird. I love it. Am I gonna go back there for that little bit of money? I, I don't think I am. I, I know what the mechanic is all about now. So we can, we can use it. No. Um. There must be something to this side right because otherwise th this wouldn't what even hit me there no don't, don't blow me up oh it's the snowflakes that's what's hitting me it's the goddamn millennials again snowflakes okay um i, I say that as being a uh, what's referred to as a millennial which is just like somebody who is in a uh, in, in a very bad identity crisis as far as their generational um, allegiance goes. <laughs> Let's go up here. So, my question remains, why in the world does this part to the left here exist? Because nothing good seems to come from here, other than a possibility of death and like 200 gold which is just nowhere near enough to make that worth it and it's really difficult to actually see the snowflakes against the background so they also just seem to spawn kind of on top of you sometimes uh could you please stop that that would be very fucking the point of this area to the left here is to clear this up so you can go that direction and then you can go up Okay, we're actually getting some puzzle-ish elements here. I quite like this until I don't. <laughs> okay. Let's keep going. 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 Uh, this is not going to damage anything. 
but it will power up <laughs> it will power up my normal attack which means that you die an awful lot quicker so I'll take that that has to be worth a check it's not it's not even worth a checkpoint okay you know what screw you and everything you stand for For the next checkpoint, I'm also, unless it's a, uh, it's a very big value checkpoint, I am also going to do the same thing and just remain taking it as a checkpoint. Uh, because, and you have to hear me out here, uh, the mechanic with that floating... You scare me. You scare me a lot. Do you go down all the way? You do not. Okay. Uh, the mechanic with that floating platform that, like, pukes rainbow platforms is really fucking fun, but it also scares me a lot. Uh, this seems like it's not dangerous at all. That's probably a chicken. It is. Okay, how much money is this checkpoint? Oh, that's worth a lot. Okay, it's dangerous, but not dangerous enough to turn down this kind of money, right? We have to kind of take that because that's like a thousand gold. And we can just take you out like that. So hopefully I didn't just make a huge ass fucking mistake. I probably did. This seems like a secret. Um, I kind of have to, don't I? This is actually not too bad. Because if you understand the mechanic, it, it's not that dangerous. Th this has to give me something good. Because it sells magic and charms and stuff, right? Uh, what do you have for me? Clear space around you with a powerful blow. I don't think I particularly care about that, but now it's available for me to buy in the village whenever I want. So, and then there is... Of course, on the way back, you, you start being difficult. No, 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 no. <laughs> that was terrifying. Okay, um... Talking about things being terrifying, I feel like I'm about to die here. Because what's going to happen? Hear me out. What's going to happen? I'm going to get onto the ice. Then the knight is going to attack me. I'm going to panic. I'm going to fall into the spikes. And I have to do the entire level from the start over again. Now, let's put this into practice. That actually went remarkably well. Until it didn't. <laughs> um, no! <laughs> Told you. Oh, I, I don't have to redo the entire level. That, that's good. Uh, but, but still, more or less, what I predicted did come to pass. So I'm going to take that as a win uh, because I lost. See, and this is why this series is giving me so many shorts. I, it's, it's lovely. It's honestly great. <laughs> it's, uh, it's kind of the best. So, going any further left than this is kind of unneeded. I hate this. I hate everything about that. Okay, remember when I uh, took that one checkpoint because it was worth a lot of money? Uh, I said it's worth like a thousand. I, I've already lost a thousand just because I took that. That's not true. That's not true at all. I wouldn't have made it back to... Uh, well, actually, yes, that is true, because I wouldn't have had to do this section again had I just taken that as a checkpoint. So, my greedy ass is uh, actually losing money because of my greed. Also because these snowflakes are actually bullshit. So, I did it again. I did it again. Okay, so what we're going to do is in this bullshit snowflake section is we're going to keep the invincibility magic because uh, otherwise th there's just literally no way that I can do this. I don't know how I did it before either. Um, it is actually the worst. I hate it. <laughs> and I should have just taken a checkpoint. Checkpoint taken. Literally. See, this is how we do. Oh my! I'm gonna shoot a bitch. But not, not in game. I, I'm going to go out, buy a gun. I don't even live in America. I don't know how or where I would get a gun in the Netherlands. I'm gonna get a gun. And I'm gonna shoot a bitch. 
Because of this map, like, th this specific screen makes me want to murder people. Not real people. If any law enforcement is listening, otherwise, maybe. Uh, but, uh, it, it definitely uh, does not make me feel fuck! It, it makes me feel... It makes me feel things. If, if you heard, it doesn't make me feel a fuck. Um, well, like, literally, physically speaking, that is accurate. Uh, but uh, other than that, it, it, it makes me feel things. I, I did this first try. And I think, you know what, I can do this again. No! No, I can't. I can't do this again. Because this is bullshit. This is difficult. <laughs> and I do not like the fucking snowflakes! <laughs> The snowflakes, dude! <laughs> God, it's always the snowflakes! Oh, maybe Fox News is right. The snowflakes are the worst fucking thing to happen to the world since, uh... I don't know. Since the weekend? You, you, you see, because the, the, the weekend is actually a good thing. But, uh... Okay, so... No, 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 no. Okay, yes, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Now we go back that direction. We go back in this direction. We, we, do oh, okay, yeah, that, that works. That works for me. There we go. And now you fucking die. Okay, we actually got back to some point. Now the thing is, we need to do this every single time that we lose the section that we died on before. Because this is supposed to be the easy bit. Believe it or not, this is supposed to be the... Okay, that is actually very helpful to know. Um, y you can just murder enemies by... by sending that thing into them. That is valuable information indeed. No! I thought I might be able to jump in between the, the, the box. Spoiler! I wasn't. This is gonna take forever. Remember when I wanted to do a, an overworld thing? Today? In today's episode? Thinking, oh, we could probably get some other things done as well. And then I think, you know what, let's do the level first and then see if we have time left. Yeah, that turned out to be a very, very good decision on my part. Uh, because... Fuck those snowflakes! Well, that's not quite a reason, but it, it, it does kind of work out that way, doesn't it? So you can just murder you like that. That saves me such trouble. Like, honestly, that, that does make things a bit smoother. Still, the, the snowflake section there is bullshit and can go die in a hole. Uh, but everything else about that map just became, like, ten times easier. So I will take it. Um, good news! I got my money back. Bad news! I lost it again. <laughs> At least this time, I think it's more manageable to get it back. But uh, that that still was very, very stupid. Or maybe it was a genius level move. Maybe because I couldn't get it back, it's better to jump to your death, get the money, lose it again, and then place it back into the world again in a place where you can actually access it. I don't know why I just changed accents mid-sentence. I tend to do that sometimes. Uh, you just kind of have to live with that. Some people's voice breaks, my accent breaks, okay? Like, I, I don't have voice cracks, I have accent cracks. I also have just, like, brain farts. I, as you can clearly see. Have you been watching these last 10 minutes? If you've been watching these last 10 minutes, you will know that my brain is... Like, my brain doesn't just do brain farts. My brain is a brain fart. Is what some might say. I would disagree. Because a fart is funny. A fart is kind of, like... Not that bad. My brain is, is just like neurological diarrhea, is, is what my brain is. And if, uh, if you want to trade brains, 
I'm quite fond of my brain, actually. I if I didn't have such a stupid, like, non-functioning brain, I don't think my content would be anywhere near as entertaining. And that's not to say that it's particularly entertaining, but th the only value that I have in my life is, is making people laugh when I fail. So, uh, if I lose that as well, there's literally nothing left for me in this world. So, at least, please don't make me be smart. Because if I ever get, like, actually good at video games, all my value in the world just dissipates. <laughs> um, upside, I don't have to get up there for, uh, for the checkpoint anymore. Downside, I still have to get up there for killing this enemy and, and moving on with the level. So we made it back to the point where I died. More or less. Let's not do the exact same thing this time. Because I kind of predicted what would happen, and then it happened anyway, but on the other side of this ice. So... Let's just... Kill you. Let's just use you as a... You know what? That works. This entire section is just designed to push you off. This entire section is designed to piss me off. Uh, that being said, no, 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 um, no, 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 no. I, I just panic press the magic button. I don't know why. We are keeping this. Uh, oh, that was probably a bad idea, wasn't it? <laughs> that was probably a really fucking. Can, can I can I reset that enemy? Please tell me I can reset that enemy. Okay, I can. Thing is, I, I literally use a setup that's a lot like this in my own game. Yeah, I'm keeping this checkpoint. Nobody can can convince me otherwise. I, I'm literally using a setup like that as a platforming challenge in one of the levels in my own game at the moment. So I really should have seen that coming. Um, you know what? This might actually work. It, it certainly will not. It certainly will not. I su I survived that. Okay, uh, so how do? Maybe just like that. Because uh, this might reach. Hold on, hold on. That might give me uh, a bit of a... Okay, we, we can kill that one as well. And then maybe this one. Uh, I, I think if we get you at the lowest point in your cycle, we might be able to... Ah, uh, but you're fucking hammers! Okay, come on. There we go. Is that the way you're supposed to do it? It's the way that you can do it. That's all that matters to me, really. No, don't you, you will respawn. You, you don't respawn them. Okay, that's good. Mid-air cancelling. Um, panic. <laughs> panic avoided. This game is actually getting kind of tricky and I'm loving it. Give me another checkpoint, please. Because the game is also fucking terrifying at times. Oh, you don't have any knockback. Very good to know. <laughs> spikes. I'm assuming these spikes can also kill from the side. So uh, let's go up. How's about that? You know what? There's probably a... Oh, the snowflakes. Because of course the fucking is. There's always got to be snowflakes. Fucking hate the snowflakes. Just get me somewhere safe. You know what? I don't really care. Don't really care about the secret anymore. I'm just going to go through the normal. No, <laughs> you bad dragon, bad dragon thing. You're trying to kill me. I don't like being killed, so I would very much appreciate it if you could just fucking stop it. I'm going to wait for you to dive again, because otherwise I'm probably... <laughs> no, there's, there's more enemies. I don't want more enemies. I want less enemies. Stop stop it with the enemies. <laughs> this is very chaotic. Ah, oh, now there's two of them. Now there's two... Now there's... Fuck me. Okay, we're actually doing something there. I'm almost out of HP. I'm almost out of HP. I, I need to be... I need to be quick. I need to be quick. I need to be quick. Make it through this map. Just just make it fucking through this map. There's gonna be a checkpoint here, right? 
Oh god, there is. I am not taking that. I am not taking that. This is the checkpoint before the boss fight. You, you could offer me all the fucking money in the world. I'm I'm not taking this checkpoint as a checkpoint. I know that that bridge is broken. Don't worry. Uh, I probably should have killed myself there because I only have one HP before fighting this boss. This isn't gonna go. This is it's not gonna go well. Not gonna go well at all. Let's see. We can maybe try to uh, get a little bit of a feel for his pattern. No, no, we cannot. We most certainly cannot do any such thing. Okay. At least we'll have full HP now. And we have quite a bit of HP at this point in the game anyway. So we should be fine. And uh, boss killer music. Uh, well, music as well. Boss killer magic is, is what I meant to say there. Because we can... Boss killer. Boss killer magic. Oh, the spikes now. The, 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 the spikes every- the spikes everywhere now! Please give me some more- Give me some more snow. Give me some more snow. There we go. Okay. No, 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 no. I'm just going to keep bouncing on you. Just gonna keep bouncing on you. Just gonna keep bouncing on you. You know what? If you're the only- FUCK ME! If you're the only platform, that- that kind of- makes it so that I have to damage you a lot, whether I want to or not, but uh, that seems like a strategy. Just keep bouncing on his head. <laughs> and if you get a little bit more lucky with the uh, RNG and the iframes, you might just kill him before anything really can happen. I maintain that this is, like, peak boss killing magic, though. Especially if they're close to an edge like that. See, it absolutely fucking destroys his HP. There you go. Boss killing magic. It's the fucking best. It, it's called something like chaos combat magic or whatever. It's 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 literally not. It's just boss killing magic. That that's that's what it's made for. That's what it's good for. That's what I use it for. It's to murder boss fights. It's it, that's all there is to it, and I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And with that, let's get a little bit more money here, and we can end this episode here. We, we don't need to do any overworld uh, stuff because <laughs> this has been quite stressful enough as is. Oh, there's more stuff to do. Fucking grand. <laughs>